Have a look at our next song, The Slow Blues. First of all, I'd like you to tell me about the rhythm. What have we got here? And here? And here? 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 Now over here, you might know these as rests or zars. But nevertheless, we've got ti-ti-ta, ti-ti-ta, T T. Who said T T ta T? I hope you didn't. Remember our T T. It's a T T whether it's up or whether the uh, whether it's up or whether it's down. Um, also whether it's on an angle. You've still got uh, two filled in notes with a beam in between them. So our rhythm. T T ta T T ta T T T T za za. Now, of course, our notes are E E. What was this one? Can we work it out? Well, just imagine what we did last lesson, and we put in an imaginary step. So we've got E. The imaginary step would be F, and this. Next step after F is going to be a G. So we've got E E G E E G E E G E za za. So let's play that after me. Get your guitar up nice and straight, sitting on your lap. Have your thumb behind the second fret there, and have your finger. Red, your third finger, just like in the last exercise, uh, soggy sandwiches, minimal amount of movement and maximum amount of control. So we've got E, E, G, E, E, G, E, E, G, E, ready, go. E, E, G, E, E, G, E, E, G, E, fantastic. Now you notice that the second line is exactly the same. E E G E E G E E G E ready go E E G E E G E E G E and the third line what do you notice about that It seems to be the same as well E E G E E G E E G E ready go E E G E E G E E G E now, if we have a look at our fourth, fifth, and sixth line, you can see that they're exactly the same as each other. But instead of starting up at uh, with an E like we did up here, we're starting now at. Well, you tell me. Is it on a line or a space? It's on a line. Let's count up our lines. Every good. Boy, it must be a B note. And then this note, we could work this out two ways. We could keep counting up the lines, every good boy deserves, or we can place an imaginary note up a step from B. So if this is B, this note here will be a C, and this note here, one step higher than C, will be a D. So I've arrived at D in two ways. Now, we don't know what a D is yet, so stay with me while we put a little sticker on our guitar fretboard for D. Okay, there's our E note there, there's our D note here. Now, E is as low as you can get. 
on the first string of your guitar. But D, as you know, sits lower than E. There's E there, there's D there. So how do we play a lower note than E? Well, you may recall that B is a lower note than E, and it's played on the second string. But actually, D is going to be a little bit higher. So let me show you where D is played. So, our D note can't be on our first string because E is as low as it goes. So we're going to have to look for a note on our second string. Now you know the name of the note on the second string, well the open string, that's B. Now our notes go up in alphabetical order, so the next note above B is going to be C. We'll deal with that a little bit later, but after C is D. So this is where your D goes. That's on the third fret of the second string. So we'll get our little sticky white dot. And that'll just go above the G, just there. All right. So, take your pen. Uh, if you haven't got a dot with a, a D written on it already, and we'll just write D there. Okay, so this is what it looks like on your guitar. So we have those three notes. We have an open E, an F, a G, and then on our second string, there's our B, and then there's our D note there. So, now that we know where our D is, we can continue with the rest of the song. We have B, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B, za, za. So that's going to go like this. B, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B, za, za. Now you might start to notice that that's exactly the same finger pattern as what you were playing previously. Before we were going E, E, G, E, E, G, E, E, G, E. Now we're going D, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B. And we'll do that three times. Can you do that after me? Are you ready? B, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B. Ready? Go. B, B, D, B, B, D. B, B, D, B, and again, my turn. Ready, go. B, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B. Now, right at the bottom of our music, we have this sign here. It says, D, S, Alfine. Now, that's short for some Italian words, which are Dal Segno, Alfine which means we go back to the sign and we finish right there. Dal Segno, I'm not sure of the exact pronunciation of the Italian word, but Dal Segno, Al Fine, from there to there. So this is what we do. Play these three lines. We play these three lines and then we repeat them. That, 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 then we finish. Let's play that now with our music. To me, E E G E E G E E G E. Next line. E E G E E G E E G E. My turn. Your turn. E E G. Next lower string, B's and D's. And go. B, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B. My turn. Ready, go. B, B, D, B, B, D, B, B, D, B. My turn.